What's up everybody, Manufactured Opinion here, and welcome back to my Kingdoms of Amalur playthrough slash guide. And today I'm bringing you the location of some really, really cool armor. Um, I'm going to try to keep it as short as possible because there's not much I can talk about while you're looking at all these locations. I will give you a few pro tips, if you will. Um, this armor is really, really awesome. It's great for all you universalists out there. It's got great stats for finesse, might, and sorcery. Um, you don't need um, any type of points in sorcery to wear this armor but you need at least 28 in might and 28 in finesse and the way I have these videos set up is that each location is by region so as you progress further through game you can you can pick up these these pieces I'm not going to show you the alabaster the final location first because a lot of people like to take their time, do the side quests and things like that so a lot of people might not be at alabaster so I've set it up by region that's the first thing, so you don't have to worry about that. Um, I try to be as specific as possible. Actually, I think I am as specific as I possibly can be showing you this, these locations. A lot of them are secret. Um, for this helm, for example, you're going to need uh, pretty high detecting to get behind that secret door. But that, that is the only one behind the secret door. Um, and if you really, really, by the time you get to Alabastra and you really, really want that final piece, the luxurious legwear as they're called, you would, you can actually just book it straight there. I recommend bringing a lot of health potions with you. Be at least like level 25 because you will get hit by everything on your way there, especially mages. But you can make a beeline straight forward. It only takes like 10 to 15 minutes as you'll see at the end of the video. There's red all over Alabastra, but you can run to it, so do not fret. Um, and that and that's basically it. You'll see the armor at the end here. You'll see the points I put into Might and Finesse to show you that you need uh, 28, at least 28 Might and 28 Finesse. Um, and that's about it, guys. The armor looks really, really cool. I hope you guys like it. Leave me, leave me some comments on how you like the armor once you get the full set. And I think I think I've touched about touched on just about everything here, guys. So like I said, leave me a comment. Let me know how you like the armor. And as always, have fun playing Kingdoms of Amalur, and I'll talk to you later, everybody. Bye bye.